Tonight we are learning more about the new impact of the raise the age law in Charlotte. The law allows 16 and 17 year olds to get treated as juveniles instead of adults in the criminal justice system. And today CMPD released new numbers about how many have been charged with violent crimes since the law took effect. Now this comes just a day after police say a 17 year old was one of two suspects involved in a violent crime spree in South Charlotte. WCNC Charlotte's Alex Shabbat is at CMPD headquarters with the new details. Alex. Well, we were briefed today at CMPD about the number of juveniles charged with violent crimes since the law passed. Police say it's too early to tell about the long-term impact, but it's already having a short-term impact. When there was a startling sound at around 6.20 yesterday morning. My wife heard screaming. Burton Fulton jumped into action. Grabbed my shotgun and ran across the street. That's where he says he found his fellow neighbors trying to detain an armed suspect in his Ballantyne neighborhood. I held him at gunpoint until, you know, you know, trying to figure out what was going on. It turns out the suspect was among two teenagers who police say were involved in a violent crime spree that morning. An adult teenager crashed a stolen car during a police pursuit. An hour and a half later, Fulton confronted the other suspect, a 17-year-old, who police say tried to carjack a woman at a home. I had no idea he was a 17-year-old guy until, you know, middle of the day. I mean, to me, he just looked like a, a big guy that was, you know, here to do bad things. Another armed neighbor shot the 17-year-old during the struggle, and he suffered non-life-threatening injuries. We have to go dangerous people who happen to be 16 and 17 years old. Just a day later, CMPD releasing new crime numbers since the Raise the Age Law took effect. It makes it so 16 and 17 year olds charged with crimes are considered juveniles, not adults. And so far, there are a total of 38 suspects charged with violent crimes, 32 of those armed robberies and a murder. It does create a, a burden for us. CMPD says in the short term, it's a stress on time and resources. A simple arrest of an adult may take two hours to get to jail. A simple arrest of a juvenile may take five hours. But they hope it'll have a positive impact in the long term. What we find is kids aren't spending time incarcerated learning to become better criminals, right? They're, they have different opportunities. In Charlotte, Alex Shabbat, WCNC Charlotte. And police say one way to determine the impact of Raise the Age is to compare the sentences 16 and 17 year olds were getting before and after the law took effect. That information not yet available.